An elderly man in southeast Bakersfield says he has nowhere to go after the county forced him out of his home. 23 ABC's Mark Christian tells us what circumstances led to the county's actions and what services are now available for that man. Because I don't know what to do. 85 year old Herbert Jackson says he's lived in the home for decades. Now all of his belongings are out on the street. It's a nightmare. Leaving behind a lifetime of memories, including raising seven kids and losing his wife. Now he's facing the possibility of being homeless. Own the house. I paid for it. I bought it in. In 1950, when I got married. County Code Compliance says they're not in the business of kicking elderly people out of their homes. This is an ongoing case that has been recurring since about 2009. And gave sufficient legal notice before any action was taken. Safety is our first concern. If there is an issue where somebody is being displaced, we do have programs to uh, provide emergency housing to persons that are displaced for any of our actions. In 2008, a faulty electrical system caused a fire, and code compliance posted a restricted access notice on the home back then. And I don't know who to go see or whatever, because I mean, you know, I didn't have money enough to get nobody to fix that for me. However, recently, when the water was shut off, code compliance started the legal proceedings to deem the house unlivable. All I know, they say I can't live here because I, my, the water is messed up in my house. County officials say they've tried to get Jackson assistance through aging and adult services in the past, but say he's refused to help or to leave the home. Very difficult when a person says, I don't want to leave that situation, in which case then it's, it's up to law enforcement to look and see what could be forced in that situation.